Good morning and welcome to day two of Vlogmas. I really hope you enjoyed day one of Vlogmas. I literally woke up to film day one like just so giddy and the same when posting it. It was like Christmas morning. Just getting to start this new thing that I've never done before. I absolutely know that I will not feel like that by the end of Vlogmas. I'm just gonna bloody hate Vlogmas and it's going to be the bane of my life, I would say, because I get bored so quickly of things. Um, so yeah, but I'm excited to be here and I'm excited to be doing day two. Today's vlog is going to be just a unboxing of some new things that I have, a little bit of a catch up, but yeah, I'm super excited. And if you haven't subscribed already, I would really appreciate from the amount of other people I follow, it's what they talk about the most is that the amount of people that watch their videos and don't subscribe i don't really understand this for for me anyway for people who i enjoy their videos i want to know when they put up a new video which is super helpful if you subscribe you'll see when there's a new video so i hope you will subscribe if you're watching my channel um but anyway let's get on with the day i wanted to come on before i do my try on to show you what my hair is actually usually like and I'm going to show you how I do the sleep back bun because for so long I was like, I just don't think I can do it. I used to look at like Matilda Jurf and be like, oh, she's using products that I don't have. She has hair I don't have. And I used to just think that I wasn't able to do it. So I want to show you that it's literally all down to the product you use. Um, I have these awful flyaways and... When I tie up my hair, just usually it looks awful. And then when I use the product, it's so polished and gorgeous. So let's get into it. So I suppose first you wanna do your little parting if you want that little parting um, at the front. And just make sure it is, I use this comb, make sure it's perfect. Okay, first step done. Okay, now that the parting's done, I'm going in with the Aveda uh, pomade. Now, there are a few of these that I will link below that are supposed to be super good as well. I have this and a L'Oreal one that I use. I really want the Wee one. O-A-I-U something. Um, but you be, you be, you can be generous with the product. So first I'm just gonna put, good bit of it in my hands and then just run it through the front to the back and you can already see how it's starting to gel back and you can see that the parting stays there Okay, then I'm going through with a regular brush and I'm just gonna brush back in the direction that I want the bun or the ponytail to go. And then I'm gonna use my back combing brush and I'm going to use this to get it extra sleek. And this is when you can start like putting it up into your uh, ponytail. Okay, when you feel like the hair is all going in the same direction, you can put it up in a ponytail. And this is where you can do a few things. I like to put it in a bun because the way my hair is cut, a ponytail just doesn't look that good. Um, but if you wanted, you could like put gel through this as well and make it a really sleek straight uh, ponytail. For my bun, I'm gonna use two bobbins. So I'm gonna go in with one first. So I'm gonna twirl it around and literally just get it into a bun. Doesn't have to be perfect. And then I'm gonna go in with a second one just to get any strays. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with extra product and the brush again. 
So this is obviously my dirty hair look, so it doesn't matter um, how much product I use, but the ones that I use I really like because actually the next day it doesn't actually look like you've had loads of product in it and you can actually do this two days in a row um which i like this gives that really wet sleek look and then you can go over it with your brush again if you need to get it super super slicked and there we are there is my sleeked back bun and I don't have the perfect no fly away hair. This literally stays all day. Um, the only thing I would advise is do it before you get dressed because then getting dressed is an absolute nightmare. Okay, I got changed because this is so much cuter. Um, okay, I wanted to open up, I kind of semi opened up this one first. So. This was part of my gift for my baby shower, but they got it delivered to Portugal instead. So this is from Smallville, and I chose, eee, they're so cute, this absolutely beautiful sleeper, or sleep suit. Oh my God, it's so soft. So this is by the brand one plus in the family and oh my god it's so small i got the zero to six months um which may be a mistake i don't know but it has the zip all the way down the side um i'll link it in the description box below but it is a quilted sleeper in a crew it has the buttons in the top and it's literally the softest material. So this will be for a newborn, zero to six months. Hopefully it fits him or her. Um, I think it's a big baby, so um, hopefully it doesn't grow out of it too quickly. Okay, so that was the first thing I got from them. I also got a baby monitor. I went for the Nanit, um, which came highly recommended, so I'll let you know how that is. this stunning blanket, baby blanket, which I'm just going to take this bow off, which is, this brand is N74 winter blanket in white, and it's organic cotton, has just these, has the stitching detail at the edges, and just these little cross details as well, so this will just be perfect. It's actually very big, which I love. So, oh, it's just, it's actually so much more beautiful than I even thought it was going to be. Um, so I really, really love that. Thank you, girlies. Now, really, really beautiful. I'll also link that hello and then let's get into the good stuff this is my first order with adanola honestly they had some problems with like the um their customer service the week that i ordered and it was pretty bad like this has only just arrived now and i ordered this in the, at the beginning of october it's now nearly december and um, so customer service wise wouldn't be a fan and also i ordered it from the uk the order was 185 euro and when it arrived the custom fees were 116. I just feel like the UK there's been so many complaints um, that they're just taking the piss with their custom fees and adding like an insane amount like 100 that's nearly the amount of the actual package so it doesn't make any sense but anyway. Unfortunately I won't be ordering from them again because just the customs is way too expensive even if I do love them. Ooh. Okay, so let's get into it. I'm gonna do a little try on as well. So I'll just open them first and then show you them try on. Okay, so I got four things. Let's start with the smallest. I love good quality socks. Don't know about you guys, but these just woolly pair of plain gray socks. 
super cute for over leggings or even with your loafers with skirts in winter. Then I got very similar to the Skims t-shirts, although the Skims are cropped. So if you prefer a not cropped t-shirt, I got this um, in a medium, the long line olive short sleeve, long line top, olive green. Um, so I'm excited about this. Really soft and feels very similar to the Skims. Actually feels um, much thicker than the Skims. So if you have um, problems with your nips, then maybe you want to go with Adenola instead of Skims. Um, and then I went with leggings, of course. The Ultimate Leggings in Dove Grey. So again, I went with a medium because I'm pregnant. Yeah. And I don't like leggings super tight. So um, they look like an, actually a pretty good size. So I'm excited for them. And then last, but definitely not least, this is what I was super excited about. I'm obsessed with crewnecks and I just wanted a plain gray crewneck. So this is the oversized sweatshirt, gray melange, melange, um, in a, oh, I went with large. I thought I went with medium, but anyway. Um, so it's actually oversized already. So I'm going to try these on for you and show you the fits. So here's the t-shirt in a size medium. I'm definitely happy I went with the medium because the small would have been way too tight on my arms. Um, and it's super comfortable around the belly. And then the leggings as well. These are the ultimate leggings. I'm like 5'2 or 5'3 maybe. And they're not like overly long. So... As you can see, they're a little bit crumpled but at the bottom, but not super, super long. I like as well that you can kind of tuck this in and it's super, super seamless. So there's not a lot of bulking um, around the belly. Um, so yeah, really love both of these. And then let's see how big <laughs> the large oversized jumper is. So I absolutely love oversized everything um, and I'm actually happy I went with the large. I thought maybe I thought maybe I should have gone with the medium but I actually really like this size. It has a really subtle, hopefully you can see a really subtle Adenola logo here just stitched in but I am obsessed with this. So you can obviously just have it all the way out, super oversized, or if you want it, it can be really nice if you kind of tuck these in to make it a little bit cropped. Super easy, two styles. I love. Cutest little socks. The very, very naughty face of someone who's just about to do some online shopping. So this is the aftermath of, that's not even the worst of it, but this is what my bedroom usually looks like um, after content filming or filming content for Instagram and TikTok. So I was doing some outfit stuff. Some days I'm really good and I clean up straight away and then other days I'll leave it until I have to go to bed and I come in in the worst mood because I'm like, no. I hate my earlier self for not cleaning up, so I really should do that now. But anyway, I'm gonna take my makeup off, um, edit Vlogmas videos, edit this video, get it ready, and I'm just gonna, I basically all of my work at the moment is just gonna be Vlogmas, so um, I have a kind of a rough schedule of what I'm gonna be doing, but I haven't put it into my calendar, so I'm gonna do that now, and, there's some stuff I have to order online. Um, I'm so happy I'm doing this Vlogmas because some of the videos will be, like I said, the organizing of, hang on, I wanted to talk to you while I take off my makeup. So as I was saying, I'm gonna be doing some organizational videos for Vlogmas. So um, I'm going to be 
doing the baby changing table and the hospital bag, that kind of stuff. Organizing everything that I've bought for the baby. Like we have to wash everything, etc. And I'm just so happy I have this because it means that I'm gonna be just come January so much more organized than I would have been because I know I would have put it off. So this means that today I'm gonna put everything from Vlogmas in my calendar and then I'm also going to uh, see the kind of things that I need to order for the hospital bag etc. So yeah, I'm super happy that I have Vlogmas to keep me accountable so thanks guys. By the way, I'm using the milk cleanser, vegan milk cleanser, and it is so gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. 